Welcome to our grade 2 money lesson. Today we're learning about adding with money. Let's go have a look what we have to do. Can you plus with money? Here is a 5 cent coin and a 5 cent coin. We have to plus the two coins together to see how much money I have. So we're going to say 5 cents plus 5 cents equals 10 cents. And a 10 cents looks like this. So if I add two 5 cents, I get a 10 cent. Here is a 10 cent coin and a 10 cent coin. I've got two 10 cent coins. So I'm going to say 10 cents plus 10 cents equals 20 cents. If I had to combine them, this is what my 20 cent will look like. Here is 20 cents and 20 cents and a 10 cents. If I add it together, which is plus, it is 20 cents plus 20 cents plus 10 cents equals 50 cents. And this is what my 50 cent will look like. So if I want to break up my 50 cents, I will get two 20 cents and a 10 cent. How cool is that? Here is a 50 cents and a 50 cents. Let's add them. 50 cents plus 50 cents equals 100 cents. How else can I write 100 cents? Because I can't carry 100 cents in my hand. That's a lot. I can write it like this. One rand. And a one rand coin looks like this. So one, rand, one one rand coin is equal to two 50 cents. And two 50 cents are equal to one rand. Here I have a one rand and a one rand. Let's add them together. One rand plus one rand equals, can you tell me? Yes, two rand. And do we get a two rand coin? Yes, we do. A two rand coin can be divided into two one rand coins. How interesting is that? And two one rand coins equals to a two rand. Here is two rand plus two rand plus one rand. Let's see if we add it together. Two rand plus two rand plus one rand equals how much? Quickly count on your fingers. One, two, three, four, and five. Two rand plus two rand plus one rand equals five rand. And if I had a five rand, it would look like this. So that means that there are two two rands and one one rand and a five rand coin. How cool. Five rand and a five rand. Let's do a sum. Five rand plus five rand equals, can you tell me? Quickly count. Five rand plus five rand. That's two hands equals ten rand. Can you remember what a ten rand note looks like? There we go. So a 10 rand note is divided into two 5 rand coins. And two 5 rand coins put together makes a 10 rand note. How cool is that? Or just 10 rand together, but two 5 rands. A 10 rand note and a 10 rand note. Now we are adding notes. So we're going to say 10 rand plus 10 rand equals 20 rand. And what does a 20 rand look like? There we go. So that means if I had to break up a 20 rand, I could break it up in a 10 rand and a 10 rand. So it's two 10 rands make a 20 rand. How interesting is that? Now I've got 20 rand plus 20 rand plus 10 rand equals 50 rand. What notes will I need? Do you know? Can you tell me what the first one is? It's a 20 rand note. Well done. 
plus a 20 rand note. And now I'm going to add two 5 rand or can I add a 10 rand note? Plus a 10 rand note equals 50 rand. So 50 rand can be divided up in two 20 rand notes and one 10 rand note. Did you know a 50 rand can also be divided into five 10 rand notes? How interesting is that? Here I have a 50 rand note and a 50 rand note. So 50 rand plus 50 rand equals 100 rand. Let's have a look at what 100 rand looks like. There we go. It's a blue note. So 100 rand can be divided into two 50 rand notes. So two 50 rand notes make 100 rand. What else can make up a 100 rand note? Do you know? Can you count in tens? Let's quickly count in tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Can a 10 rand note make 100 rand? Yes. How many do I need? 10. 10 fingers. 10 10 rand notes make 100 rand. And can 20 rand notes make 100 rand? Let's quickly count in twos. In 20s, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. Five 20 rand notes make 100 rand. How cool is that? Okay, so here we have a 2 rand plus a 1 rand equals a 3 rand. So what would my coins look like? It's a 2 rand coin plus a 1 rand coin. So 2 rand plus 1 rand equals 3 rand. But we have no coin for a 3 rand. Did you know that? Good, I'm glad you knew that. We only have a 2 rand, 1 rand and 5 rand coin in silver. Let's have a look at our next sum. Here we have a 5 rand and a 2 rand. Can you tell me without me putting it up what my sum will be? Quickly shout it out loud. Good, it is 5 rand plus 2 rand. Can you tell me the answer? Let's quickly add it together. So we've got 5, and we're going to carry on counting. 5, 6, 7. I added 2. My answer is 7 Rand. Well done, grade 2s. Do I get a 7 Rand coin? No, I don't. Here I have a 5 Rand coin, a 2 Rand coin, and a 1 Rand coin. Can you quickly add those up in your head? Have you got the answer? Shh, don't tell anyone. Let's see what the sum is first. 5 rand plus 2 rand plus 1 rand equals, uh, I don't know. Quickly count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. What's the answer? Can you shout it out? Yes, it is 8 rand. 5 rand plus 2 rand plus 1 rand equals 8 rand. And we also don't have an 8 rand coin. Now we've got notes. 20 rand plus 10 rand. So we're going to say 20 rand plus 10 rand. Do you know the answer? 20 plus 10 equals? Can you, can you tell me the answer? Yes, 30 rand. Now again, do we have a 30 rand note? No, we don't. We have a 20 and a 10 rand note. Here we have 50 rand, 20 rand, and a 10 rand. So we're going to say 50 rand plus 20 rand plus 10 rand. Can you tell me the answer? Quickly count in your head in tens if you have to. Have you got the answer? Shout it out. 80 rand. 50 rand plus 20 rand plus 10 rand equals 80 rand. Okay, so let's do a word problem. Sam's mom gives her pocket money every week if she helps around the house. Sam got 
10 Rand for vacuuming her room on Monday. On Saturday, she got 20 Rand for making supper and washing dishes. On Tuesday, she got 5 Rand for picking up the litter. How much pocket money does Sam have? Hmm, so it's a plus or minus sum, what do you think? Yes, a plus sum. But let's look at the money she's got. She got a 10 Rand note, she got a 20 Rand note, and a 5 Rand coin. Now we have to plus these things, these amounts together. So we're going to say 10 Rand plus 20 Rand plus 5 Rand. Do you know the answer? Quickly count in your head. 10 plus 20. 10. Let's count in 10s. 10, 20, 30. 30 Rand plus 5. 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Did you do the same? The answer is 35 Rand. Done great twos. Now, what would my number sentence be? Yes, it will be Sam will have 35 Rand all together. Our last sum for today. Today, Mom gave a nearly 20 Rand for Tuck Shop. He bought a Coke for 10 Rand and a packet of chips for 5 Rand. How much money does I nearly have left? What does that mean? Do I plus or minus? What tells me it's a minus? Yes, it's the word left. Now let's see. So Anneli has 20 Rand. He buys a Coke for 10 Rand and a packet of chips for 5 Rand. Let's see what our sum will be. Do you think we add those all together? Mm -mm, because we have to minus. So let's have a look. So 20 Rand. We have to take away 10 Rand. So 20 Rand minus, there we go, minus 10 Rand. We take it away. Minus 5 Rand. We take it away. Equals what? So I've got 20 Rand. I have to minus 10 Rand. So 20 minus 10 is 10. Well done. Now I've got 10 fingers left. I take away 5 fingers for 5 Rand. How much do I left? Yes, I have 5 Rand left. So that means 20 Rand minus 10 Rand minus 5 Rand equals 5 Rand. So how much money does Anneli have left? Anneli will have 5 Rand left. Well done, grade twos. That was hard. You did so well. Well done, grade twos, for doing so many money sums today. In your homework, there are, there are some sums for you to do today. Put on your money thinking cap and get started.